hey what is up my geeks and freaks big girl geek here with a brand new video and today i'm here to review wonder woman bloodlines a dc animation official original animated film so y'all know what time it is it's time to go Three, to geek out two, all right so i just happened to catch this um bloodlines movie um today earlier today and here is my review for it i loved it i think um dc animation cannot be touched uh not by marvel animation um or any other really animation if you guys been watching this channel you know i love young justice outsiders i've said it a million times that dc animation is like number one it's up there i don't know why they can't correlate that greatness to the movies but yeah the live action movies but yes the animation top notch so you can catch uh wonder woman bloodlines um i watched it on amazon um i think it's available for maybe it uh, may be available to rent i actually purchased the the film so i own it in my library and it, uh rosario dawson is returning as wonder woman she's done the voice as wonder woman for a couple of uh uh dc films and she's i like her she's great chris summer is in, in it if you know anything about animation you know who chris summer is and who she's voiced uh like a long as this as long as my arm longer of um animated characters that chris summer has uh voiced um if you're not familiar you may recognize her from a different world she was on that show um so yes she she was in Disney's Atlantis. She was a princess. So yes, Chris Summer. She does. She plays um, Apollo. She plays uh, Princess Diana's Wonder Woman's mother. Um, I can't remember the guy. He was on this TV show Burn Notice. The main guy from Burn Notice on USA. He voices Steve Trevor. Um, so this this film is strictly a standalone Wonder Woman film. Um, it does have a small origin when she first meets uh, Steve Trevor and rescues him from a burning. Uh, plane when he accidentally enters the mascara he's being chased by the uh, power demons from um, dark sides like minions and it starts like she rescues him and it goes very quickly she decides like she's going to leave and help and we all know that whole story and if she leaves she can't come back yada yada uh, we've seen that a million times so it's very fast it's very fast that origin part of it and then she it, it does a time jump and she has she's known as wonder woman on earth she um is in the justice league they mention the justice league and they even mention superman but you don't see anyone else she is the only superhero uh with superpowers that you see everyone else is like her supporting cast like steve you do see um her fight giganta and uh, cheetah who are her uh, villains in her you know comic book and you get some great fight scenes you get some great um dialogue they do curse in this film um, so if you wanted to, to watch it with, you know, a kid or um, something like that, just be mindful. There are a couple of curse words, not a lot, just a couple curse words like bitch and something like that. Um, but it's not heavy. It's not heavy on the curse words. So yeah, you don't see Flash, you don't see Batman. It, like I said, they mentioned the Justice League and they mentioned Superman um, and that's it, but you don't see them. And I thought the story was great. She, fight, she fights her big bad villain at the end and it's, uh, it's a great long um fight scene i won't give it away i won't you know i don't want to give any spoilers away but i i really did enjoy um the film i give it a 10 out of 10 it's very hard to critique and rate the animation of these comic book uh characters that we love it's easier to do the tv versions and the movie versions <laughs> but it's kind of hard to do the animation because they get the animation so right and it's like nothing like i said the only thing if i had a critique was that i felt it was rushed in the beginning but um other than that no it was great animation was great um dialogue like i said script was great um acting's fine you know nobody was delivering monotone lines it was all great so um that was my quick review of wonder woman bloodlines please do check it out let me know what you think in the comments as always i can't wait to discuss with you until next video i'm out of here big girl geek out peace hey where are you going you just watched a cool video Subscribe.